Hey guys, okay, so I'm, my mood's been like up and down, I've been feeling really depressed and stuff, so I'm doing a vlog, and these are kind of like, I'm going to show you books, kind of help me get through depressing stages, or depressing books, dark books in general. Alright, so the first one is cut, it's like this, and it's by Patricia McCormick. And it kind of follows around a girl who, her name's, um, her name's Callie, yeah, her name's Callie, she cuts herself, and her parents found out, and she keeps quiet and stuff, but, and she gets sent away, and she kind of learns how to deal with her problems, and there's only like, I think only twice they mentioned about her actually cutting, and I can relate a lot to this book, and I don't know, I just really like it. The ending might surprise you, and the reason she starts cutting might surprise you, but it it's a great book. Uh, the second one is called Skinny, and it is by Ibby Cowslick. And it kind of is one of those books that one chapter, it talks about one, it's one character, and the next chapter is another character. Um, so this follows it's Holly, Holly's... Um, Giselle, she's um, it's kind of like in a mental state right now. She doesn't really know what's going on, and she's trying to suffer from her anorexia, from binge eating, from everything like that. An eating disorder that's taking over her life and stuff. And it kind of goes to her struggles, and you find out why she does it, why she became that way. And then on the other chapters, when it's not talking about Giselle, it talks about Holly. And Holly, she's Giselle's sister, and she watches her go through this, through her struggles, and she kind of wonders. Like, how can I help her? What am I doing wrong? And stuff like that. So it's a pretty good book. Um, the ending is pretty sad, I have to say. But overall, I really like it. Um, the next one is Gus Alice, and it's by Anonymous. So you don't really know who this book is about. Falls this girl. I'm sorry, I forgot the names. Falls this girl. I forgot her name. Alright. Alice. It's not, it's not Alice. I know it's not Alice. Oh, let me try to find the name because I don't sound stupid. I wonder if, I think they, they mentioned, I know they mentioned her name. Alright, I can't find the name. So, um, basically it talks about this girl and she kind of goes through these these weird um she, f she tries drugs for the first time she runs away she tries life on her own she comes back she runs away again moves to like moves out with a friend and all this like good stuff starts to happen but then it's like really depressing because you're like oh what's gonna happen to her she gonna be okay and it's overall a great book to read Alright, my hair's going crazy, and I usually have a headband to control all this, but I don't right now. So yeah, she kind of goes crazy in a way, and you kind of like read through it, and it's really interesting. It's definitely a page turner. It's kind of hard to get into sometimes, but it's really good. Other not as depressing, but slightly cool, is a book by Emily Strange. Emily Strange book, it's called The Lost Days, and the only reason I say it's like kind of, it's not really depressing it's kind of like the dark stuff as you can see by this and what's really cool is that you get like all these like wait you can see like you get like little drawings so yeah there's, there's little drawings throughout the book which is kind of fun to read and kind of like a children's book but it's a lot better than that but overall, the story, it's kind of interesting. It's kind of like a mystery, because basically in this one, Emily, she doesn't know. She's in this weird town. She doesn't know why she's there. She's completely lost her memory. She doesn't know who she is. And like throughout the process, she's regaining her memory and stuff. And then you realize, oh, this is why I came here. And then here is this other book. And it's called 13 Reasons Why. And it's about this girl named Hannah. And the reason I know this is because I'm currently reading it. 
I'm like, like, I'm like, there's, I have like, that much left. So, it's about this girl, Hannah, and she commits suicide, and she leaves, like, notes and stuff. Not really notes, she leaves tapes, and she sends it out to 13 people. And the guy, I forget his name, oh, I'm sorry, but the guy, the main story of this guy, his name's Clay, yeah, now I remember, not this cut I read to you, but it's Clay, he like, he's, he gets the tapes, and he's like, well, I liked, he kind of like had a crush on Hannah, he's like, I liked her, what I do wrong, why am I on these tapes? And I haven't read it all, I'm really excited to read it and see what happens. But, um, my friends who have read it, they said he's, he, um, he's on the tapes for a reason, but it's not, he isn't one of the reasons why she killed herself, though. So, um, that's basically it. Um, maybe vlog time, I guess? Um, currently, I'm in break for school. Um, this past semester, I've had really bad grades, though. So I don't know if I'll still be going to that school. So hopefully I will. Hopefully I won't. No, hopefully I will. Hopefully nothing bad will happen. But I've been really depressed lately. My mood's been like, I've had mood swings. They're like, woo. Olivia's mood swings are like, well. So yeah. Um, I'm not really going to go really into that. For sure going to try to make more videos. Maybe creative videos. I don't know. And the reason I'm filming on my webcam is because my dad's on a trip right now and he took my camera. So, not really good quality videos. Not like I have that many either. You know, background. My room. Um, might do another video. Might not. If you, if you hear music, it's my iPod. I'm listening to Face Down by Jumpsuit. Red Jumpsuit Apparatus, and it's on repeat right now, and, oh, funny thing about the song, okay, like, I heard it, and I was like, oh, this cool song, I love the beat and stuff, and not until recently, like, I've had this song for, like, months, like, yeah, almost, a, maybe almost a year I've had the song, and I listen to it, and I think it's cool, but not until recently I've, like, really listened to the words, and got a new meaning for it, and it's kind of like, oh, this kind of goes with my life kind of in a weird way. So yeah. So sorry for rambling on. Um, I think I should give you links. And st I, should, I should start getting links to stuff I like or I'm into right now. Um, yeah. So bye for now. Um, maybe I'll start making new videos. Maybe I won't. Maybe this was a pointless video, but hopefully we'll get up to that. I'll figure it out. Alright, bye.